The first African-American woman to serve on the St. Louis County Council has died. Hazel Irby was 75. She died after a battle with pancreatic cancer. Fox News' Jeff Bernthal is live outside the St. Louis County government building tonight with reaction from those who say Hazel Irby was a true leader. Jeff. It was 2004, Elliot, when Irby first started serving the first district here in St. Louis County. Friends of hers say she was simply passionate about representing North St. Louis County. They say it is that passion that now inspires them to follow her example. Hazel Irby brought North County communities together and formed a coalition to help give a voice to those who felt left out of county government. She will be sorely missed, I, I tell you. This is a very, very deep hurt that I have right now. Current first district councilwoman Rita Her Days admired Irby's passion for representing her district. The first district has had many challenges and she knew that and she addressed them to the best of her ability, but always the, the citizens of the first district uh, were, were always her main concern. I call her the queen of North County. She was, she was so, well respected you know even if you disagree with her on something the respect uh never was lost several north county mayors credit irby for giving their communities a voice by bringing them together work with our youth work with our uh elected officials work with our clergies she just worked with everybody and she always put the other people before herself she would be sorely missed and we all have a great model to uh, move her legacy forward. County Executive Sam Page chose Irby to be the county's first director of diversity and inclusion, but then replaced her. Irby filed a discrimination complaint contending she was punished for raising red flags over concerns involving county contracts and whether minorities and women were getting a fair share of business. Friends say throughout her entire life, Irby fought for the people she represented. I think that was her strength, uh, being level-headed and, uh, you know, maintaining your cool, uh, you know, through whatever adversities there were. And I, I mean, she even did that through, through this diagnosis. I, I just sometimes, I marveled at how well she handled that, but she did. Now, today, St. Louis County Executive Sam Page called Irby a passionate advocate for those she represented on Fox 2 News at 10 more about how she is being remembered. Reporting live from Clayton tonight, Jeff Bernthal, Fox 2 News.